Good morning, everyone. Today is Thursday, May 14th, 2020. Today is the Feast of St. Matthias, and we only hear about St. Matthias one time in all of Scripture. So in all the Bible, he only comes up once, and it's in the New Testament. As you know, after Jesus is crucified, Judas is no longer one of the 12 apostles. So Peter decides that they need to fill Judas's spot with somebody else, and Matthias is chosen. What's really interesting is that Matthias is a really quiet figure in all of the Bible, yet he ends up having this really important role as one of the proclaimers of good news after Jesus' death. He's really, really important with beginning and sharing the news about Christianity, Christ's church. So today, we pray this morning in our morning offering that we can be like St. Matthias, that we can proclaim the good news, even though we might not always be the loudest or the strongest or the best or the one that really stands out. We pray that we can be the light of Christ, the voice of the good news to other people that we come in contact with. Let's begin our day in prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. O Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your Sacred Heart in union with the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world, in reparation for my sins, for the intentions of all my relatives and friends, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father. Amen. St. Thomas More, pray for us. St. Joseph, pray for us. Mary, Queen of Peace, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. And now you may cross your hearts as we say, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, we've got a few birthdays on our campus today. We've got a couple in kindergarten and a couple in second grade. So in kindergarten, Logan P. Happy birthday, Logan. Also in kindergarten, Charlotte T. Happy birthday, Charlotte. We hope both of you have a great day today. In second grade, Molly K. Happy birthday, Molly. Also in second grade, Tristan T. Happy birthday, Tristan. We hope you all have a great day. As you know, we've only got a couple of days of school work left. We still have one more week next week. That'll be filled with lots of fun things, including our final parade next Friday. But until then, work hard today and tomorrow. Get your work in. Don't forget to thank your teachers. Thank your parents. They've been helping you a lot too. Let us know if you need anything in these final days. We're here for you. We're praying for you. And be like St. Matthias today. Be one who shares the good news and shares the, the word and the love of Christ. Have a good day, everybody.